here I got some nodules, four rough nodules uh, that are of a jasper type. They're called the Whiskey Creek Jasper and I got these from my good friend Philip Stevenson uh, who, who is mining these stones and um, I just got these four samples because I was curious on how they would be cutting so I have never cut any of these stones before um, these will be the first ones and I'm excited on how they're going to turn out so there's three smaller nodules where there's no hints of what could be inside this might might actually be maybe a double one or I, I don't know what actually could even be inside and this one's already showing some some sort of banding um, but yeah I will find out together with you. I just finished cutting uh, these Whiskey Creek Jasper nodules and um, I didn't have high expectations because I just haven't seen a lot of the material and I've never cut any of this type and um, I think some of them turned out better better than I expected. So the first one, the first one I cut um, is just a little piece of jasper and has like a cavity in the other half. So I think this is the least exciting one. Then this was the last one I cut. You can see it has like some some kind of um, brachia in in the bottom area here, and also some banded jasper. So I think that's a decently nice one. Then actually the one that I thought might be a double chamber actually turned out to be a double chamber. And I think that looks actually pretty cool how the broken pieces settled at the bottom of each of the nodules and formed this kind of layer with the broken material at the bottom and then the clear banded jasper at the top of the stone. So I think that's quite a nice piece. And the last one also has the same combination of the broken section here at the bottom and then Later it seems like it has been filled in with another layer and jasper on top, so I think these are actually quite nice. <laughs> 